Hi YouTube. Um, okay, long time no vlog. Um, I haven't done a vlog in a long, long time. Um, I've kind of been sort of all over the place at Christmas. Um, and Dad's just got over cancer. Uh, so I kind of sort of dedicated my life to sort of being around him and helping him out and doing what I can for my mum and whatnot. So I've kind of been in that situation where I've sort of had time to myself, but just been in that sort of mode where should I do a vlog or should I watch a film? I'll watch a film and I've been doing a lot of stuff on my computer so I, I just I haven't had the time I've been sort of like I've got into a mode where I just like I wanted to do one for ages and just never got round to it I actually shot two vlogs uh, to put on here uh, and edit and never got round to editing them um, I did one where I went to London and saw an alien trilogy uh, the whole Alien Saga back to back and I also did one where I met and talked to Danny Boyle uh, unfortunately that footage didn't turn up too good and uh, basically ended up with me basically filming the chair in front of me rather than me actually filming Danny Boyle speaking to me um, I was lucky enough to get a, a special preview of 127 hours before Christmas before it came out over here and uh, yeah I got to ask my question but I will admit the question I asked him wasn't really that great and just, I don't know, the audio exists but I didn't really think it. Maybe I might put it on here one day. But um, apart from that it's kind of sort of, hmm. But um, no, I've just, I've been trying to look for something kind of cool and cool and, you know, something interesting and nothing really has come up. I haven't found anything that was, I just found, you know, cool to talk about. And in the end I just thought, you know what, I've got to do a vlog. I've got to do some sort of vlog. And I thought, the best thing, since I haven't got much to talk about, I will do one vlog in particular because it has to be said this week is a very important week for me uh, this week is of course the Oscars uh, this Sunday the Oscars are happening and I cannot wait for them so I'm going to do my Oscar predictions um, okay best supporting actress um, I've got a funny feeling this will probably go to um, Helen Morgan Carter I hope she does win because I think she's been in a lot of films where she's been nominated and hasn't really got one. Uh, best Supporting Actor, I think it's got to go to Christian Bale. I think it would be a real disappointment if it doesn't go to anyone but him. Um, best Actress, it's got to be Natalie Portman. Um, Black Swan was absolutely phenomenal. Um, very well done and I really think hope she gets it. Uh, best Actor, I don't think anyone can beat Colin Firth. I think that's pretty much impossible. Uh, so I hope he does win. This is, I will admit, I'm not a big Colin Firth fan. I've never really been a big Colin Firth fan. And just, I've kind of avoided all these films, but I really wanted to go and see The King's Speech and just automatically was like, damn, he's good. But, um, you know, it would, it would have been nice to see someone like uh, James Franco go up for it and, you know, get an Oscar. But yeah, again, it's just one of those years where he was due to get one and then suddenly everyone else went to him and just like, nope, no one's going to get it. And again, like um, Jeff Bridges, Jeff Bridges' performance in No Country of Win, fantastic, but he would never win anything. It's really one of those years where everyone's sort of, all the brilliant talent's gone in on one, and it's just, ugh. But um, now we get to the, the big two. These are the ones I really don't know. Um, I think David Finch is going to win. I've got, a, I've, I'm really kind of hoping and praying. Um, that Fincher wins Best Director. He deserves it. He's, you know, a serious talent out there. And I really think he deserves to win. Um, in terms of this picture, it's pretty much a toss up between The King's Speech and uh, The Social Network. But I do think it has to be said. I think The Social Network will win. And uh, I got this the other day and I absolutely love it. Apart from the fact that I watched it one the other day and got really depressed, the fact that I wasn't a billionaire. Uh, I've seen it a few times, it's like, it smells brilliant! I watched it one day just in the wrong mood, I was just like, I'm, I have no money, I hate my life. But, um, oh, a little question for anybody that has this out here in America. I would like to know if David Fincher swears throughout the documentaries on disc two. I want to know if he swears or whether or not they've been beeped out. Because the English ones have been beeped out, and I know that I've had discs before that are like sort of. PG-13s in America that do have a heck of a lot of swearing during the making of. So I just want to know whether or not in the in the like the main documentary on this, 
I think he swears in the first six minutes, so let us know about that. Because I'd love to know whether or not you actually do hear him swear or whether or not he's bibbed out. But that's just me being fussy and just, you know, it's one of those things that just sort of pickle me. I'm like, I wonder if that is the case, but, you know, it doesn't matter. But, um, but yeah, so yeah, I've had, you know, I've just been doing this and that. I've been going to the gender clinic pretty much every two weeks for the last, uh, since about October, really, October, September. Um, I'm meeting a psychiatrist just to sort of talk things through. Uh, everything seems to be going really, really good. I had a good session with her today. And unfortunately, in two weeks' time, it's my last appointment with her, which is kind of thing. Because I actually thought I was going to really go see a really boring old sort of psychiatrist who just, you know, why do you want to be a woman? You know. But uh, I've seen a really nice girl called uh, Felicity. She's really, really nice. And uh, it'll be a shame to the last one next week, so the next, next two weeks. So. Um, so yeah, so apart from that, as I said, I've been doing a lot of stuff and just been sort of all over the place with personal life and everything, so I haven't had a chance to think whether or not I'll be able to do these as often as I've wanted to or where I started out doing, I don't know. Um, you know, I'm going to try and strive for at least one a month and try and keep you guys, girls updated, because uh, I do love you out there, there's, there's such a good community on here. And, uh, you know, I've just made, I've made like so many friends, I think I've got about 280 friends at the moment. Uh, I could be completely wrong with that, I could have, I think, I know I know, I was going to do a vlog when I reached 250 and I'm way past that now, so I think I've got about 280. But, um, you know, that's just amazing to me, so I'm very, very thankful. And uh, although I don't get the sort of hits I used to get, it's uh, it's still it's still lovely to know people out there you know, enjoy watching me, so... Alright then, girls, I'll, uh, I'll catch you later. See you soon. Bye.